corn is all around us here in Iowa, in the fields, in our gas tanks, and also in a lot of the products we use. Alyssa Preston joins us now. She's sharing how corn is used in baby products. Look at all this. Thank you so much for being here. Well, thanks for having me today, Megan. Well, first, you are with Iowa Corn, so you work full time. You are also work on your family farm, and you're a mom to be with with a little girl already at home. Yes. <laughs> how do you do it all? <laughs> well, that's a good question, and there's some days that I really wonder. Uh, but it, it just takes balance, and um, you know, my husband and I both grew up on a farm, and we knew that's the life we wanted. And through hard work, we've been um, able to both work full time and farm, and uh, raise our daughter, and then expecting baby number two in December. So. Um, adding another farm helper, I guess you could say, to the farm. <laughs> yeah, I asked you before we started this if you've already put your, your first child to work on the farm. Yes, Jalen is a farm girl. She will also, she also loves to be a princess, <laughs> which is acceptable as well. I but love it, well-rounded. That's right, that's right. But she uh, really enjoyed riding with dad in the tractor and she got to drive the combine this year. So she really loves to be out in the field and she still asks, is daddy in the field and they're actually done with harvest oh, good. but she she's already missing being out in the cornfield <laughs> well it'll be back soon soon enough anyway this is, baby announcement is so adorable by the way uh, I can't remember what it says but coming in 2020 baby yeah. 2.0 right <laughs> <laughs> yep yep it says corn and soybeans aren't the only thing growing this year uh, baby Preston 2.0 December 2020 and Jalen is really excited to be um, a big sister. She's got her dollies out and she loves to give them bottles before bed mm -hmm. and I attribute daycare to um, helping her be prepared to become a big sister. So she knows that once harvest is over with and uh, we get out the Christmas tree, uh, baby Time number two baby. can come. <laughs> <laughs> well it looks like you've already started preparing. Um, you have brought a lot of these baby products. A lot of them are, are made with corn. Tell us about that. Yes, so corn is in over 4,000 products that we use oh, every wow. day, including several baby products that you can see here. Um, diapers and wipes, um, a lot of toys and rattles, the cups. Um, corn can be found in a lot of plastic as well. And also baby shampoo huh. uh, and uh, lotion has corn in it as well. Now, how do we know uh, if corn is in it? Because we're not gonna like see it on the bottle, right? Corn is an ingredient. <laughs> right, right. So you, so it comes from um, byproducts of, of corn, and you can find those names on, on the label. All right. Well, this is great. So you've already started stocking up on diapers. Uh, I have my kids had that little that teething the the little um, John Deere corn cob. Are there a lot of also farm products that like look like corn out there too for babies? Oh yeah. Yep. There's corn rattles. This this John Deere teether here, um, which was Jalen's favorite, and um, a lot of a lot of tractors um, that are made of plastic and that have corn in them as well. Any advice for moms to be out there expecting this winter in the middle of a pandemic? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in the middle of a pandemic. Uh, enjoy it. It goes by fast. You will probably wish the newborn days away, but really enjoy enjoy those snuggles and um, those cold winter days that you get to sit at home and snuggle a cute little baby. Yeah, that's always priceless, especially when you can look out on your farm, right? <laughs> right, exactly, exactly. Especially when Iowa provides great views uh, with the scenery that we have. All right. Well, thank you so much, Alyssa. We really appreciate you sharing your expertise of um, as an expectant mom and sharing all these products that are made with corn. Like I said, I had no idea all the products. 4,000, you said, are, yep. are made with it? So over 4,000 products that we use every day, including baby, baby products, the toothpaste that you brushed your teeth with oh. this morning, and the cosmetics that you use to get ready for the set as well. All right. All of us use it. Well, thank you so much. Thanks, Megan. And if you'd like to become a member of the Iowa Corn Growers Association, you can call the number on your screen. That's 515-225-9242. For more information, just go to their website. That's iowacorn.org. You can also find them on Facebook and Instagram. Their handles are right there on your screen. Don't go anywhere. Halloween 2020 doesn't have to go down the tubes because of COVID. Coming up next, we'll have advice on how to entertain safely this holiday weekend. We have a celebrity party planner joining us next on Hello Iowa.